What is organic farming? Organic farming is all about the production of crops or livestock using natural sources, nutrients and methods. Some people use the terms low import farming or organic agriculture with the same meaning as organic farming. If you are involved in natural forms of agriculture such as biological pest control or crop rotation, you are practicing organic farming. Using ladybugs to keep down the aphid population rather than spraying crops with chemical pesticides is an example of biological pest control. If you are an organic farmer, you do not routinely administer antibiotics to your livestock. Conventional farmers, on the other hand, do. It is wrong to say that organic farmers never give their animals antibiotics. If a cow has an infection and the vet recommends a course of antibiotics, the organic farmer will probably follow the vet's recommendation. The US Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says that antibiotic use in animal feed helps control, treat and prevent bacterial diseases in animals. However, to slow the spread of antimicrobial resistance, these drugs should only be used when necessary, the CDC adds. There is much more to organic farming than simply opting not to use artificial pesticides, fertilizers or genetically modified organisms. Organic farming is a holistic system which optimizes the fitness and productivity of diverse communities within the agro-ecosystem. According to DEFRA in the UK, organic farming is a method of farming that requires farmers to operate to a system based on ecological principles which impose strict limitations on the inputs that can be used to minimize damage to the environment and wildlife. Emphasis is placed on natural methods of production and pest control. Organic food and drink cost more to produce because organic farming is less efficient than conventional or intensive farming. You will have to pay more for a pint of organic milk compared to its conventionally farmed equivalent. When the disposable incomes of organic consumers drop, as often occurs during a severe recession or a period of high inflation, they may revert to non-organic produce. Some people comment sarcastically that going organic is an option just for those who can afford it. Organic produce costs more because organic farms are typically smaller than conventional ones. Without artificial chemicals, crops take longer to grow. If you do not use growth hormones, there will be less pork or beef per pig or head of cattle.